I know some beauties in Cali, they all be calling me daddy. What's up you guys, welcome back to the channel. If you are new, do yourself a favor, subscribe. Hit that bell notification, come join the team. All right, today's video. The poof just keeps coming out. The poof just keeps coming out of the woodworks. I'm telling you, all these girls I follow, like, for some reason, it just seems like they're snitching on themselves. You know what I'm saying? Social media has paved a new way to express yourself. It's basically like their diaries, you know? So, the funny thing about this specific video, which is called, She Doesn't Wanna Be Single, okay? Is that I thought of this topic last night, and then today I saw this story post, okay? Now let me break it down to you. It was two story posts, all right? She said, she reposted something, but she said, having multiple people isn't it. Having that one genuine vibe is everything. That's a cry for somebody cuff me. Lock me down, I'm tired of thotting. Tired of it. And then she has another one, right? The very next one, being single is trash. I roll emoji, I roll emoji. I wanna get in trouble for the shit I post. Crying laughing face emoji, crying laughing face emoji. All right, you guys, look. Let me break it down to you. See, this is a prime example of a woman who who also plays hard to get, also carries herself like, you know, I'm just the baddest in the world. Ain't nothing wrong with that. She bad, that's cool, great person. But at the same time, even though she might give off that vibe like, I don't need a man. I don't need a man for nothing. I can take care of myself. I'm independent, I'm a boss. I ain't nobody to be messed with. Look. Clear as day, she says she want to be locked down. Locked down! All these women want one. Even if girls are out here talking to multiple dudes, you know what I mean? It looks like they sleeping around, just dying away. Trust and believe, they do not want that. They do not want to be doing that. They want to be out here, but with one dude. Just one solid dude to lock them down. The reason I'm telling you this is so you could get it through your head that you are valuable as a man. If you have everything you need to offer a woman, you are valuable. So you don't need to be intimidated and worried about, well, am I worthy enough to be with her? Just a second. Look, man, your manliness, you know what I'm saying? It means something. Don't take it lightly that you got your stuff together. Don't take it lightly that you don't put up with nonsense from a girl. Don't take it lightly that you know where you're going in life. Just don't take anything about you lightly. Don't, don't take the fact that you work out daily. You do push-ups. Even if it's just minimal workouts, you doing it. Don't take it lightly that you're eating right. Don't take it lightly that you have a business plan that you work at every single day. Don't take it lightly. So the next time you see a beautiful woman and you're like, you know, she probably got all these dudes that she talking to and this and that. She wants one. The mindset that you need to have is that I am that one. She will be lucky to be with me. She needs me. She does. She'll, she'll try to put on the front like she don't need you. You saw those posts and then the next post will be like, hey, I don't need a man for nothing because I got my own bread. I do my own thing. I'm good all on my own. God damn, I'm lonely. And then they'll be like, they still try to like look strong, right? So they'll be like, I just need a man to build with me. Every queen need her king. I'm a bad boss B. I need a boss man. They'll, they'll do anything to make it seem like they don't need you, but they want you. They need you. They need you. Biologically, they need you. You know what I'm saying? They need you to reproduce, technically. Meant that we could just get a sperm down there and start like, but you still need the sperm, you feel know I me? Mean? So. <laughs> um, nah, but yeah, man, just, just don't be so nervous and overthinking things when you go to pursue women or when you're talking to a woman or dating her. Just honor your time, honor your energy, honor your efforts. 
know that she is privileged to be around you to be spending time with you and if she gets to ever date you officially lock you down you just blessed her but you know a lot of guys out here i've been in this situation too you know we sometimes you you feel like you're not enough you feel like you know i don't have my 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 money right right now well hey if you can acknowledge it cool bet at least you know what you need to do you don't always have to be exactly where you need to be in life to succeed with women you just need to know where you're going and once you realize that that's going to boost your confidence a lot more because you know i always tell you confidence is key with women like a sense when you got it or you don't and knowing where you're going in life and what you need to be doing and the value that you hold as a man gives you confidence and it gives you real genuine confidence you feel me so stop trying to compete with other dudes because you're not in competition only competition you're in is with yourself because that's the only competition you can be in honestly you got to wake up every day trying to be better than you were yesterday constantly improving every aspect of your life, including game. That's why you need to download Winning With Women, link in the description, and make sure you got it down, bruh. Look, don't let these women fool you. Don't let their facade that they be putting up get you intimidated, get you, you know what I mean, shook. Because it's a facade, that's all it is. Underneath that hard shell is a layer of just soft and plush and gushy and woman. You know, you know, women now are trying to be hard, like men, you know what I'm saying? It's very unattractive. At least I feel like it's unattractive. I'm like, why are you acting like a dude? You're not a dude. They be like, yeah, that's all period. Like, calm down. You can't even formulate a full sentence. You talking about periods and stuff. You don't even know where commas or asterisks go. Like. Ah, <sighs> uh, hey, but for real, women are feminine at heart by nature. Obviously, they're feminine because that was that's not what I meant. They're like they're sensitive. That's what I meant to say. <laughs> they are sensitive. So just know that and know that if you know how to kind of like play with her emotions in the right way that she's gonna fall for you. She gonna like you. She gonna love you. She's gonna chase you because you're supposed to be chased. She wants to be taken. She does not want to be single. When girlfriends get together, what do they talk about? Dudes that they wanna date. Like, oh, I would lock him down. Oh, no, no. Like, I've heard conversations like women take pride in even just hooking up with a guy. You think dudes be saying, yeah, I smashed that, that. Women, they be like, yeah, I knocked him down. Yeah, like, I got him. Mm -hmm. I'm, I was like, what? Y'all be talking like that? That's crazy. But it's true. So, um... Yeah, remember, you are the prize. Don't be intimidated. Be overly confident. Know where you're going in life. And go after it every single day. Everything's going to come together for you. I believe in you. Now it's time for you to believe in yourself. That is it for today's video. If you guys liked it, please do me a favor. Hit that thumbs up button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And Team is we the best team in the league. Until next time, focus on you. And the women will so I know some bitties in Cali, they all be calling me daddy. I know some hoes out in Texas, they all be showing affection. I know some hoes out in Georgia, got the whip on the forward. Know some bitches up in Nazi, and they all be